Well, hello everybody. It's Erica and I am here to doodle today. Even though I'm not really doing a doodle, I am doing an actual drawing, but it's not Thursday, so I'm here to doodle a drawing today. <laughs> and I hope you guys are doing good on this lovely Monday morning. If it's Monday when you're watching this and if it's still morning, it's a Monday morning when I'm making it. So I hope you guys are doing good on a Monday morning. And if you're not, I hope you're doing good uh, whatever time of day it is or night. <laughs> so I am here on Monday. We're going to go with Marijuana Monday. And I am doodling a hemp leaf today. Uh, in case you didn't know, there's, you know, cannabis has different names. Lots of different names, actually. And what I'm doing is a hemp leaf from this cannabis sativa plant. And this poor little leaf, it's gotten a bad rap over the years. <laughs> it's almost a little uncomfortable even talking about it, but I'm going to talk about it anyway. <laughs> so one of the other things I love to do is cosmic. So we're doing this, this hemp leaf as a cosmic leaf. And I'm using um, some of the Bombay inks I have. And I'm also using some Calero Golds. Um, Calero metallic watercolors and I will leave a link for all of the products that I use with this piece in the description of the video so if you want to check any of those products out if it's something you might want to use there will be a link to everything that I use in this video and the salt I use for the cosmic effect the texturing there that's just Himalayan sea salt from the store that came in a grinder I just ground it up and used it I was using table salt before this but I didn't have any regular table salt in the house, so I figured I'd try the Himalayan sea salt. And it worked just as good as the regular table salt. So if you don't have table salt and you want to try this out, and you like Himalayan sea salt and that's what you got, it should work too. <laughs> Alright, so hemp is a strain of the cannabis sativa plant species that is grown specifically for the industrial uses of its derived products. It is one of the fastest growing plants and one of the first plants to be spun into usable fiber 10,000 years ago. It can be refined into a variety of commercial items, including paper, textiles, clothing, biodegradable plastics, paint, insulation, biofuel, food, and animal feed. And that is just a small little tidbit I got out of Wikipedia. The, the, I'm sorry. Wikipedia. That's a little tidbit I got out of Wikipedia. So um, yeah, if you want to know more about that, you can always go to Wikipedia and do a little research on the, fl the, the flower, the plant. I'm not sure where you're at, but um, I'm in Florida and I know that this one still has a little bit of a stigma to it, but it is medical use in Florida. You can get it if you have a medical marijuana card. And I was actually to Colorado twice before Florida became legal for medical marijuana. And I remember the first time I ever went into a local shop. It was the Kind Mine in Idaho Springs, I believe. And it's closed down now. It's not there anymore. But yeah, it was so cool to be able to go in and just purchase marijuana. And you could look at it and smell it and pick what kind you wanted. I mean, it was just so cool. <laughs> so... And then I remember coming back to Florida and just being just so bummed out because you couldn't do that in Florida. You could do it in Colorado, but you couldn't do it in Florida. I didn't get it. This is the United States of America. We're supposed to be united. How come they could do it and we couldn't? <laughs> but it's changed a little bit now, so we can do it now. So I want to thank everybody so much for listening to me ramble about hemp and... I probably got a lot of things wrong, so if you want to leave a comment, you can always correct me. <laughs> and I will talk to everybody in the next video. Thank you so much to all my subscribers. You guys are awesome. I really appreciate you. And I will see you guys again, maybe before Thursday. All right, love you guys.